Hello everyone, quick tutorial for the Iron Man Infinity War foam build. This comes from Mohammed Harun, wanting to know how to scale the armor. This is assuming that you've already downloaded the Pepakura by Tamasoft and the rw3dstudios.com uh, Infinity War Iron Man armor. I'll have a link in the description for you to download yourself if you want to get started and, and take a look. So once you've clicked download, it's a big zip file. One of the benefits of this file is it comes with a whole body piece for scaling. So this is where you want to start. So you, when you open this up, click it, and it creates this file here. So this, you want to first scale to your own body height. So you go to 2D menu, change scale, set scale. So this whole body piece uh, is 72.5 inches for myself so you know let's say it was 68 inches and you needed it a little bit higher so again 2d menu change scale set scale if you've converted this to inches from pepakura when you first opened it up uh, you can do inches if it's still in millimeter again just find out what your height is convert it to millimeter and adjust accordingly to the height so again, I just rescale to 72.5. Uh, the width and depth automatically adjust. Hit OK. And now all of the pieces on the right-hand side of the 2D menu uh, have adjusted accordingly. So let's say you want to scale the same uh, size for a chest piece. I'm going to do a chest piece as an example. So over here, click on the chest piece so that way it lights up on the right hand side zoom in because you want to find two points that you can accurately measure so I'm doing this diagonal piece here at the bottom of the chest click 2d menu edit mode measure distance between two points zoom in a little bit closer because I want this accurate so here is the start. A little red dot will appear. I'll click it. Now I'm going to find another spot where I want an exact straight line. So that tiny edge piece at the very bottom of the chest piece, I'll click again. It'll automatically show me the distance, 2.68. I like to click and click again just because I want to make sure I get the same measurement and I'm not picking another point and it's showing inaccuracies. So this is 2.68 inches. I'm going to type that here. Here it is already. Now that you have that number here for your chest piece on the whole armor, we want to do the same measurement on the isolated chest piece. So we're going to scroll in on the 2D side. Okay. 2D menu, edit mode, measure distance between two points when you when you're close to a point a red dot will appear click it now find the exact same spot as you did with the uh, whole model here there you go and then click it again 2.38 inches now let me try that one more time just to make sure it still says 2.38 2.38 inches okay so I want this length from here to here. I need it to scale up to 2.68. Here's how we do that. So we now have 2.38 inches. Write that number down, 2.38. Now in the isolated chest piece here, look for the height. On the left-hand side here that I'm seeing, it is 11 inches. So we're going to write that number down as well. 11. Now here's where we start doing some math. Okay. So, on the isolated piece, we saw that the measurement between those uh, those two points it was 2.38 inches. A little small. We need it to be scaled up. We also saw that the height of our isolated chest piece is 11 inches. What we want is the 2.38 to scale up to 2.68. This is the number that we don't know. We need to scale the height 
from 11 to whatever this number is going to be so that way the measurements will be exactly the same. So how we do that is we take 2.68 cross multiply 2.68 times 11 in this case 2.68 times 11 we get 29.48 we take this number here and we divide it by this number so in this case 29.48 which is 2.68 times 11 we divide this number by 2.38 this gives us 12.3865 12.3865 right here 12.3865 okay so remember that number or we'll write it down somewhere you're gonna reference that so go back to your chest piece 2d menu change scale set scale in the height section type in 12.3865 in this case 3865. Hit enter. So when I now look at these exact same two points that we've been looking at on this one and the hole for reference, it should be exactly the same. So 2D menu, edit mode, measure distance between two points, scroll down, when you see a red dot appear, click move your mouse until you're down at the bottom of the other point that you wanted to measure before and you get exactly 12.68 inches so going back to the hole for scaling same thing here 12 or 2.68 I said 12 earlier uh, 2.68 inches 2.68 inches so now we know that all of the other measurements here the height the width everything about this chest piece is exactly the same size as this chest piece here. And since you know that the height is exactly the same as your height, you can confidently print this out, cut it, uh, transfer it to foam, and you know it's going to be exactly to your dimensions. And that is it. Thank you so much. If you have any questions, let me know.